Welcome Capricorn to my channel, Rainbow Wizard. I'll be doing a reading for Capricorn, Sun, Rising and Venus signs. It is for the end of September. All right, Capricorn, it's going to be a very quick reading. Uh, I've left everything to the last minute, uh, not really on purpose, but other things happening. So um, yeah, let's see what is in store for you. Um, wow, sorry, if I can even shuffle. <laughs> so um, yeah. Check out other signs in your chart. I'm trying to fit in um, a few more signs and I might just post everything in one go. <laughs> All right, Capricorn. Please like, subscribe if this uh, reading resonates with you. Okay, <clears throat> someone here is on a standby or really want to connect with you. They are, uh, they are just waiting and waiting and waiting and they think, oh, I'm never going to get this chance. Uh, this person could do something drastic. They come rushing in here. This person could be an air sign. Um, I do see that um, this, this person might be Libra. So... There's definitely love in the air here. This person here is, um, there is someone that could be on his way out of your life. Um, out of your life. They could be maybe leaving a Libra. They've been staying in a situation. The situation has just been draining. It's like, and, and, and has not been moving forward. You could, Capricorn, based on this stalling and this kind of could it's kind of a battle there's someone there's like a battle with it but there is love showing up wow so yeah capricorn i you could be leaving someone you could be leaving someone this person is coming up and you're reading very strong um this person might not see this coming Yeah, I. there is something happening very, very, very quickly for you in September, Capricorn. I see that for many of you, there could be a connection again that have, yeah, well, it's run its course pretty much. And maybe they thought that you will fight for them. They thought that they desire for you to fight for them because they are someone to fight for. Maybe this person has something to do about their work or they have been working on this connection if you had a relationship, right? But at the same time, you could have told this person that they are so stingy, right? They're not really, you know, there's an end. You, you ended things for a reason. This, this person could have air in their chart. You ended things for a reason. and But still, they are uh, sometimes just come rushing and with random communication. It looks like they are also stressed because you are moving on from them emotionally um capricorn and it has to do with a new person showing up this person could be pisces strong pisces you have been reflecting away and you have realized that you have let this person go uh capricorn and what you don't see coming it is a soulmate union coming towards you uh, unexpected but it's coming towards you and you want to give to this, they want to give to you, this, the lovers here. This is a very strong union. Uh, I see that you, it gives you this union, meeting this person gives you strength. You feel they are right for you. Again, the person that you're dealing with in the, in the past, they were sort of giving sparingly here because it's just something about their personality and the way they are. They're just not right for you. This Again, I'm picking up this relationship have run its course. You know that something is coming towards you. Someone is coming towards you. I see a uh, Capricorn, a, you want to take action in love here. I think you could be taking action away from a Libra, a Pisces that might be thinking that, or Cancer, 
Libra is here, Scorpio, Scorpio is here as well. Someone is going to be, you might be moving towards an Aquarius. Aquarius. Someone, a Scorpio could be very hard, uh, Scorpio here is heartbroken. So uh, I will clarify briefly here. Um, Okay, please give me some messages for the person that Capricorn is, is dealing with. Yeah, this person, they want to fight for you. But in the current surroundings, there's something that they are bitter about. And therefore, it separated you and them. They are realizing now that you are the love of their life here. There is a, an ending with a Libra. I'm pretty sure of it. Or a Scorpio. There is someone, yeah. It could be three women here as well. So this person could have done something foolish. Maybe they try to connect with someone from the past. Um, this person is overcoming something i just feel like this it, it could be a new person i'm seeing someone here they're heartbroken over a libra they're trying with they're heartbroken in general they feel like life is unfair this person is someone that is quite lighthearted. They like to have fun. It could be someone at your work here. I'm picking up as well, Capricorn. They're having an awakening here. They are noticing you. They are coming towards you. This person, they want to give equally to this connection here. This person could be, they have a lot of wealth, right? They, they want to, um, they might look serious uh, at first, but they're not, they're not so serious. Um, but I do, something difficult happening at this person's end, right? You and this person have history. I do feel that this person here, if you have water in your chart and um, Pisces, Cancer, um, yeah, this person here, they think of you a lot. They think when that you work, you're always on their mind. This connection here is deeply rooted. They will never be able to move on from you but every time they move forward they could be quite fickle they come forward with a small offer they are realizing right what they're doing wrong but then they're not doing anything this person is a bit stingy with their words stingy with how they are and just you know just trying to fight for to hold back their feelings this person they just don't seem that it seems like really hard work then capricorn there is someone here that is showing up organically in your life uh, to uh, to give to you but it's at that point you are going to choose you are shifting uh, you're shifting like the strength to tame someone and to put up with someone's behavior has made you strong but it's also made you uh, shove down your own feelings you could, uh, again, be, have spent a lot of time on your own and, and you could sort of, maybe both of you, the new person and you, have been spending a lot of time on your own. Okay, who's this person coming towards? Yeah, it's, um, it's you're open to something new here. This person could have Virgo in their chart here. There's someone that you're leaving out in the cold, um, Capricorn. I do notice um, 
many uh, there could have sort of been a reunion during Mercury retrograde, or there is definitely a, a, a relationship that's been together for well over past it, its expiry date. Because something is, is there is you know you're open to new ideas, you're intuitive. This person is someone that you're very curious about. They're very curious about you. Uh, this person, right? It's like. Yeah, they really put you on a pedestal. They think of fertility, growing a business. They think of children, right? There is someone that you are leaving um, Capricorn to move forward to your happiness. It's possible that a person that you're dealing with, um, they could be so gutted that you're able to move forward. Maybe you didn't think that you were going to move forward as well. And they have this hold on you. They, they think as well that, oh, you know, Capricorn will never move forward anyway. So I can just take my time. I just need to make a little bit more money, something like that. But you intuitively, you know that someone is coming towards you. I do think that this person had Pisces in their chart. What is the future for... Um, for Capricorn and their person. It's as if like in this cold and something that is sad, something good is happening. It's a mixed bag of emotions. You are letting someone go, but at the same time you're happy about letting someone else in, but you know that a chapter could be over and you don't really want it to be over. You are sort of hanging in between here. Capricorn, what is going to happen here with you and this person? What is going to happen here with you and this person in September? Yeah, you know that the only way is forward. See, there's someone that you will connect with with Pisces. You are once there is like a Pisces connection here. It's destined. See, it's destined here. There's there's destiny. See here, it's just waiting for the right time, waiting for that message of love. Right, there's a there is a long term relationship here. Someone could be leaving in Aries. Maybe it felt like it was divine. This is very very strong. See here, there's something very strong here. It is uh, th this union is not just a union. This is something that is you have manifested, uh, Capricorn. You manifested this to get out of this kind of hermit mode or feeling that you cannot move on from someone maybe you were letting someone back into your life constantly but it's just about it's like okay maybe not today but you feel that something is coming and then boom two people here i feel this new person and you is like the emperor and empress it is it's not really about like the status but it's just it, you could be surprised about the feelings that you will have it's like this inner guidance you both are manifesting each other it's quite powerful here you could work together as well they could look at you Yeah, there's love in the air with this union here, um, Capricorn. Say no more. Someone will be very sad about it, but yeah, you they are letting someone go. You are letting someone go. Yeah, just something here is meant to be, and when it happens, it's like, oh wow, this uh, it's new. I I definitely see it's new. It has to do with manifestation. You could have Gemini as a, a Venus sign. They could have Aquarius in their chart. Could have Scorpio in their chart. You could have uh, Sagittarius in your chart. I mean, this union here, it's, uh, it's like underestimated. This could be sort of uh, a message, someone reaching out with a message, a smile, something that seemed that, oh um, my, this is not... This is not more than what it is, but it really is here. It's, it's love at first sight. Revealing the secret here. That is two people thinking about each other heavily and is waiting to close up this chapter here. It's two people coming together and healing their hearts together. I see both of you have healing to do in this, but it's not in a toxic way. It's that within love, like ready to receive and give love. Um, any more messages here? Um, any more messages for Capricorn? Wow, it's 
beautiful cards here. I mean, this is um, this is uh, love uh, and romance that will make your day colorful. <laughs> I, I see that two people do not expect that they actually have these feelings, like even available. It just happens. It happens from a small connection, and it starts. Um, but it wasn't ready to connect, but it's someone that is around you already, uh, Libra. Someone is already around you. They are, this could be an air sun. I'm seeing air, air. They are looking at you, or maybe they, they see that, they think that you are cold or <laughs> aloof, or they don't know if you are interested in them. Yeah, this person don't know if you're interested in them. They think that you, yeah, they think that you have other opportunities here. Someone here, yeah, with a Ten of Swords, there is an ending, right? Uh, someone could be... Someone could be leaving a fire sign. Your person could be leaving a fire sign. Um, and there, you know, there's some hermit, hermit mode going on here. But see these two people coming together. Realizing that they're supposed to be together, the magician. This is manifestation. This is definitely manifestation here. This is something that you have manifested, Capricorn. You manifested this person. I think now when they're coming in, you could be sort of, oh shit, I'm just going to, I just need to, to do something first. <laughs> it's a bit like that, but this is two people coming together, almost like, doesn't matter what which way, direction you turn around. This this is a twin flame union, is is, is manifested and it's coming. <laughs> but here it is that you could, it's like you are like no no I just need to do something first I just really need to do something first because you're releasing maybe a fire sign maybe it's you that releasing a fire sign you have to release someone it's a bit like a, oh we're gonna have a, a last little party it's, it's just you know that with this new love there's gonna be less time with someone else they could also be a friend right you know there's uh it could be an you know, male friend or the, it's something about a masculine here. Maybe it just could be a father figure. It's just something, it's like sad because this love is very powerful and you and this person, maybe you're traveling and you know that you have to sort of, you know, you want to spend time together, but it's like you could sort of get pulled into one world together and you just will not be able to let each other go. But there is a bit of sadness here because you don't want to let, um, you don't want to stop. Uh, there's something here. It's something about sadness, but I think it's going to work out. I see two people here that are very balanced together. I see two a connection coming together. There isn't like a pressure. It's a very nice and flowing connection. Very, very easy going. I like it. Capricorn, these were the messages I had for you. Please do like, subscribe and uh, share the video.